The Dallas Cowboy fans around the world want to know, is this quarterback position up for grabs? Does Jerry Jones want Dak Prescott or does he want Cooper Rush in the game? Guys, welcome back to the show. If it's your first time watching, please like and subscribe. Let's dial into Dak Prescott and Cooper Rush because right now, we know Dak Prescott's hurt. We know he was the man out there. He had his teammates. He had C.D. Lamb at the wideout position. He's got Ezekiel Elliott in there. But man, as soon as he got hurt, it was almost immediate, like it was supposed to happen. Jerry Jones is jumping ship from what I see, from all the interviews, everything he's saying. It's not just a debate. It's not an athletic or, or a competitive debate. It's almost like he jumped ship. But here's the thing. I got news for Jerry Jones because even if he likes Dak or doesn't, heading into Monday Night Football, you got Cooper Rush going in there. So at the end of the day, Dak Prescott is paid. Dak Prescott is paid a lot of money. Big contract. So the minute he gets hurt, don't you think that the organization or the owner or the head coach, they stick by Dak? I know they've done it for years, and I'm not saying sometimes you don't got to go to the next QB, but it seems like they said, look, Let's get rid of him. I mean, they must have a lot of money, obviously, because they're just <laughs> dumping him off ship and saying, listen, Cooper Rush, you know, he's in there. I never said these good things about Dak Prescott before. and then, So it's a little hard to say, hard to swallow, because Dak Prescott, one day he's the man, and the next week, guess what? Cooper Rush is the man. And, and listen, there's nothing wrong with the competitive nature of sports. The backup quarterback should be good. If we're talking high school or little league, maybe the backup is nowhere near as good, right? There's not as many great gifted players on one team, but this is the NFL. And when you're in the NFL, you've got great players in every position. The backup's backup's backup better be a damn good player, right? So guess what? Cooper Rush is in the game. He's going against Monday night against the New York Giants. And this guy has a chance to win back-to-back -back games and guess what? If Dak Prescott comes back from injury and people are like, look, yeah, put Dak in, there's going to be a lot of questions. If Cooper Rush is winning week in and week out, the fan base, the organization, and people watching football, especially if you're in that locker room, you're going to want the guy who's winning in the game. There's nothing against Dak Prescott. And I'm not saying they don't want him in the game. I'm not saying that they don't ride with their quarterback. But if you start winning week in and week out, you know, say Cooper Rush goes, you know, five and one, six and one. You start to get to the point and say, look, this is our quarterback, at least for this season. The 2022-23 season, this could be your guy. And let me tell you something. Do not let Cooper Rush get to the playoffs and win some games. Because if he does, Dak Prescott's going to be in the hot seat. And let me tell you, if Cooper Rush doesn't do something, you're going to see that head coach in the hot seat. So at this point, guys, let me tell you something. You break down these two quarterbacks. When you talk about Dak Prescott and Cooper Rush, it's the NFL. The next player's got to win. The next player's in the game. And right now, Cooper Rush has a chance to win for the Dallas Cowboys. And don't forget he got his weapons. That picture that I pulled up before, I'll pull it up again, where you have Ezekiel Elliott and C.D. Lamb. That picture right now is replaced. Dak is gone Cooper Rush is in there. He's a gifted quarterback. He's got the same exact weapons. So it's not like he can't get it done. It's not like Cooper Rush can't get it done. And right now, he's got Monday Night Football on a big stage against the New York Giants to prove that he's the guy that should be in for the starting lineup. Thanks for watching and tuning into the Brandon Mason Show. Please remember to like and subscribe. Until next time.